Hello, it's Thursday the 4th. I'm FX Blue and this is the Market Brief. So the IOD has been on, where the economy looks likely to have slipped into a recession last month. The Institute of Directors has called for a rate cut to stimulate growth. The IOD's Business Confidence Index fell to a low in December and sentiment among the director members has been pretty depressed since the summer. For what it's worth, Brexit is also raised as a major challenge to business growth with all the red tape and bureaucracy still affecting those businesses trying to export to the EU. Happy days. So the Bank of England is facing more calls to cut rates, but a cut at the next MPC meeting, which is on February the 1st, seems a little premature when we still saw some votes for another rate hike at the last meeting. Much will depend on how far the economy has fallen into recession, because don't forget, Bailey is comfortable with the idea of a mild recession, as this could help bring inflation down towards their 2% target. Um, Over in the US, Powell is facing similar calls for a rate cut, which look equally likely to be ignored. The Fed is pretty insistent that rates need to remain higher for longer in order for inflation to fall further. Um, Broadly, confidence does remain for a US soft landing, but as more data reflects the effects of those rate hikes, so more economies will start, um, economists rather, will start to sit on the fence. So we should expect to hear more rhetoric suggesting a soft landing is no certainty where the job isn't done on inflation, especially where job creation remains solid. And that's a relevant consideration for tomorrow's non-farm payrolls data. Most expect another half decent number, around 150, 160,000 new jobs, but there are always going to be a few negative Nellies who think we are due that long-awaited drop-off in job creation. Tune in tomorrow to place your bet. But ahead of any sweepstakes shenanigans, the dollar has managed to retain its recent gains and the dollar index peaked around 102.72 as sterling slipped to 126.15 yesterday. Good morning. We kick off around 126.80 against the dollar, 116 against the euro and euro dollar is around 109.30. On the open, I better go and rescue my dog. If you do not have a clue, then just tweet through and ask FX Blue.